Very. Oh, he... You saw that? Jotaro shook his head when Ulsan picked the open wall stage. He shook his head in disapproval. He obviously <laughs> wanted to have the mix-ups at the wall. And the thing is, with the Korean players, I call it the Korean classic. They excel in open stages because of their movement. They're naturally, they have you know superior movement to probably most regions. So this is going to be a tough draw. I think you're right. The pressure will be uh, less than it usually is for Jotaro here. Yeah. None so of this mix-ups at the wall. When it comes to fighting a character that you may not be you know familiar with, it's all about how you're able to control the matchup. And if Ulsan is able to control it just with movement alone, he's already won half the battle. It's all about landing the hits and making the right reads. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to go into this matchup. What could potentially be the last match here of the one eSports Second 7 Tokyo Invitational. Right now, Joe Taro from Team Japan going up against Fate Ulsan from South Korea. Kazumi's in the lead. Yeah, they're dancing back and forth, looking for opportunities. The, the crowd is packed, actually, man. They're getting ready to find out who's going to be able to come out on top here. And, you know, obviously the Japanese crowd here, they want to cheer for Japan. They want to cheer for Noctis. Uh-huh. The follow-up here. Out. Decent damage there. Yeah, and he has the life lead. Uh-oh. Ulsan, he got the read on him, got the up forward four and the follow-up. Looking really nice right now. I think I'm going to have to start in my pocket Noctis this weekend. Yeah, man. <laughs> okay. Throwing out the back one again, trying to create some space. Nice. Yeah, Ulsan hasn't been able to chop away that much as he had in the previous matches. Oh, he wasn't ready for that. Not that time. One of the things that we really haven't seen, and there we finally saw it, is the running two from Ulsan to get that pressure to keep him up close there. Well, then was it Chanel earlier that was kind of sidestepping at just the right moment against Noctis? Yeah. I feel like at certain ranges, uh, the sidestep is very, very effective. Uh, oh, goes for the mix up. Oh, didn't get the, got the spike instead of the launch. Gonna have to be careful, though. Don't want to run into the rage drive. Chops away. Oh, those sidestep in that. Nice. Attack. Perfect timing. Woo, look at that. And Ulsan staying alive for his team. Counter right. hit. Yeah, that was a big counter hit. It had it landed where it counts. Down and the tiger. Oh, having another opportunity here. Nice punish from Jotaro. Fishing for that magic four, right? Yeah, I mean, that's a, a very strong move in and out of itself. I mean, it's speed overall. There wow. it is. <laughs> you called it, bro. You hella called it. It might not be enough to kill, though. Run up. What's Tiger's not strong enough, right? Yeah, Tiger's, uh, Tiger's got nerfed. It's not Kazumi. It was the Tigers. Two rounds to one. Wulsan fighting for his team's life here. All right. Jotaro looking to change that, of course. He has been the MVP so far in this set. Oh, did you see that duck? Magician's four. Ulsan. Magician's four once again. Into the mix-up. Double dash. What you Jotaro's gonna do, Jotaro? very uh, composed here, though, blocking most of the hits. I feel like he's going to... Oh, there. That's a big risk. Finally threw something oh. out. Nothing from Ulsan, though. Trying to create an opportunity, but using that movement. Finally, he gets wow. the right read, but did not crush it successfully. That's a homing attack, too. That's Goes for that utilizing. risky move, though. Oh, the second hit. He wasn't ready. All it takes is one more hit. He can Nine seconds left. It's come down to this. Oh, my gosh. The life lead. Do something. Ulsan. Chop away. And oh, look at this. The final round here. Will Jotaro take it with Noctis? Are we going to be Square Enix boys forever? There's so many 3-2s with no punishes from Jotaro, though. And that's the thing, too. Like, you thought it would have been punished? Jotaro. Maybe it's a mind game. You don't think he'll do it again, and he does. Oh, he's working that lead down. This is putting Ulsan in a very bad position, because if the time runs down and he has to play the uphill battle, it's going to not look good for him. Now is the time for her starting to attack. Jotaro is playing outstandingly. Not going to do too much damage because of the float in the aerial state. There's the running tackle, but look at that. He's in the lead now. Oh, they're going back and forth. Not many mix-ups from Fly either. Yeah, he just flew in just to cover ground. Oh, that's oh this launch. could be big. It's not going to be enough to kill, though. Let's see what he does with it. Okay. The mix-up, the run-up. Sliver. Oh, nice. and he's got him moving. Finally. Jotaro finally falls, huh?